next year. Impressive. Very good. It's tough. Thank you, Steve. Bad yeah, nice. <laughs> yeah, this is what a Fisher Price offered. Oh, damn, I didn't even see this. Why oh, did you I not see it. that? I know. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm sorry, hiding. Sorry, sorry, yeah. I love that yeah, yeah. as well. Yeah, I had one of those at one stage. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. Hey, I got injured on one of those. Did you? Anyway, so we're loving our toy idea. Yeah. Keep your ideas oh, coming. Oh, and we're going to have a game of morning. Connect for all a bit later on as well. Anyway, oh, more on Christmas toys yeah. uh, to come. Also, in the next half hour, just what effect could the collapse of the year. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, let's just leave that, eh? George Michael <laughs> kicked off his UK tour last night. Who caught up with him, eh? Sat. Oh, it's horrible. I sat on my chocolate bar. I've got... I've got... Oh. I get every George Michael gag in today at some point during the show, and that was the one I was 15, 16 years old. Ridiculously yeah. young. Yeah, yeah. And then got massive. Mm -hmm. Brilliant, mate. I mean, it was an astonishing show. Mm -hmm. It's so slick. He knows what he's... You originally didn't want to do it the last time. Brilliant. 80s were the best, I think. Yeah. Best decade for toys. <laughs> uh, we'll have more on those a little bit later on. Nick Dixon, meanwhile, is continuing his tour around the UK's most bizarre collections this morning. He's uh, somewhere different. Uh, so far, he's met a lady who... We find Nick in Tunbridge with a Who fan. Three albums now, and I've seen the kind of audience progress throughout the time. And what's nice now is I'm playing... We are in earlier with us, obviously, and we uh, got a chance to actually hear... Just gone 8 o'clock, good morning. Hi there, welcome along to Daybreak on Wednesday the 26th of October. So it's come on the show, uh, born way... Uh, I think it's called... This. I don't, I'm not sure... I'm Anne Hillary. <laughs> no, nothing as big as Zachary. Apparently no medical reasons for young Zachary as well. Has he been putting on weight as large babies as well? Mm. You, Matthew, you... I was 10 months. Were you? Yeah. Oh. Look at me now, <laughs> six foot four. 15 ish. I was about 8 pounds 4, I yeah. think. Yeah, yeah. No, there's a trend big. here. So, big first baby, bigger second baby. Having My Rosie, obviously, and little Zachary. <laughs> <laughs> It could be hers. Actually, you'll be interested. 60 days, time's hook. We've been talking about our favourite toys of yesteryear. Phil Ray Smith has been giving us uh, the rundown of what. Um, we've been talking about um, classic Christmas presents of years gone by. It's 60 days to Christmas, could you believe? So we'll be looking at uh, some of the, uh, the top Christmas presents that will be coming out this year. But we've been asking you guys at home for your suggestions as to your favourite Christmas presents of years gone by. Yeah, Steve is losing himself in etch yeah. yeah, I'm trying it's... to draw a face, but it's not really working very well. Oh, yeah. yes, of I course. Mean, there's, there's... And Twister, obviously. Which you you. Abby O'Neill didn't want to hear anything about Christmas. It's Halloween. This will leave you with this. This is brilliant. L.A. House and Halloween.